Welcome back everybody, this is Lizbarina300 speaking, I hope all y'all enjoyed the previous video, I know I enjoyed making it for all of you. Uh, in the previous video we got a new character, um, gaming, which was actually very lucky of me, although I don't think I would actually be able to do a draw today, I hope I can, but we did mostly messing around in like the previous stuff and all of that. And we did missing around twice, that's why I labeled it as part two. So, we can jump right into this one, everybody. There we are. 96%, that should get three hours. Three, oh well, two and a half, because I'm late. Oh, so let's uh, jump right into this one here. Oh, uh, don't forget to like if you um support this content and my streams and videos. I am learning how to edit stuff, so hopefully next month, the month after that, I'll be able to um what you call it, be able to. Have these the short form thirty minute videos everyone's used to. Um. So yeah, that was very close. Um. Hello. I would want to go to class, but I'm doing the dance of the class right now. And now this one here. Um, no, we gotta talk to Charles. Let's see, we got gaming yesterday. As I said, I really wanna get this character. I really wanna get her. Hopefully, eventually, I will be getting her. I'm doing the dance with quest question. What will it be? Grape juice or apple cider? Hey Charles, have you seen a blonde stranger who hmm? wears an eye patch around here by any chance? Wait a minute. I'm not done this. That I have. He comes here every night. Just to Wait drink no though. One. Doesn't order anything else. He even sometimes mixes his own drinks after he orders them. I don't know anything else about him, but from his selections and mixes. I'd say that he's quite the connoisseur. And what's mm. Master D. Luke's opinion? Why, I just gave it to you. Quite the connoisseur. Investigating everything as always. Guess that's D. Luke for you. If you're looking for that gentleman, he ordered some new bottle of wine in advance yesterday. So he should be here today, too. There's too many raucous patrons on the first floor, so if you want to wait, best to go to the second. Not Rochelle. Uh. Yeah, I remember correctly, he sits here. Ah, welcome, sir. The wine that you previously ordered is here. He's really here? Let's go downstairs and have a look. We shall. Yay, 
Yes, this guy. Wow! He's got no intention of paying us any mind, huh? A traveler, you say? <laughs> Why are you traveling? <sighs> oh, no, sorry. Well, that's as good a reason as any. Sit down over there, then. So, guess we've broken the ice. What a weird guy. Mm. Hmm, that little one beside you. Uh-huh, we're the best of friends. It's indeed a good thing to have someone accompany you on your travels. Very My true. name's Dainsliff. I suppose you have some business with me? Sure. Ah. Uh, oh yeah. You were so cold just a moment before. Hyman's got a bad feeling about this. Mm -hmm. But I will require advance payment. Five hundred mora, and three answered questions. The 500 is a one-time fee, and we'll settle the questions in a moment. What is with this snake? What does snake mean? Ah! <laughs> Never mind. Uh, make sure you agree and follow the rules. There we are. There was no snake. That's it. Well, now Paimon's got a really bad feeling. That kind of compensation can't be right. Ah, thank you. Now, as for my questions, I'd like you to answer them here and now. The answer to a question says nothing about right and wrong, only about differences in attitude. I only wish to know what your choices are. You need only answer. Question one. The crisis Mondstadt faced was resolved by an alliance between yourself and that... Animo Archon who calls himself Venti. Who, in your view, was the key to ending that crisis? I know everything that I should. <laughs> well, answer the question. Is that your answer? Hm, I see. Question number two. Rex Lapis, who is defending the Uir Harbor for millennia on end, used his gnosis to lay down a contract to end all contracts, of which the stipulations are still unknown. Who do you think will defend the Uir Harbor in the future, now that they've lost their deity? So that's your answer? I see. Now for my final question. This world has people who gained visions and those who did not. Which of the two do you think hold more importance in the eyes of the gods? So, this is your answer then. <laughs> I understand. It seems that you're different from him. I should have known you were talking about. <laughs> I'll take that 500 mora. And now I also understand your views on this world. As we agreed, you may now commission me. That said, I only take commissions related to the Abyss Order. Like you, I am currently on a journey. You intend to find your sibling, while I wish to oppose the Abyss. Ugh. Those creatures that serve the Abyss are the fangs and claws by which the Order spreads chaos in this world. Nice I me. have come to Mondstadt this time while on the trail of an Abyss Herald. An Abyss Herald? An even more twisted Abyssal being, one that commands the Abyss Mages. Oh, that's right! 
We've just been fighting against the Fatui and Liyue, who are human too. Mm -hmm. We haven't encountered the non-human abyss order at all. There's some reason behind that, I'm afraid. It's possible that they may have been under orders to avoid your path. Oh, that does sound pretty dangerous. <gasps> Maybe they're looking for a better time to ambush us or something. Same thing, but a different view. Uh-huh. We're super duper strong. That manner. It's just like his. Uh... Uh... Things just weren't working. Plus, my brother needed the laptop to um, check things with coding. And I just said, don't let it affect anything. He was running a code command that lasted about 52 minutes. And, well, it made me late. And you couldn't cancel the command prompt or it would, like, glitch the computer. So, yeah, here we are now. Well then, let's go see for ourselves, shall we? According to the leads I have on hand, the Abyss Order has re-infiltrated the Temple of the Falcon. Let's meet up at the Temple. Perhaps your questions about the Abyss will be answered there. Yeah. Let's go. Wait a minute. Hold that thought. <laughs> Wait a minute, what? Uh... Collect like Wound Guard. I already have Wound Guard, but a lot of them. Hmm. Yeah, 400 meters behind me. This one died, yep. Um... Wait, there's two. Yeah, I'm gonna kill both of them. Oh. 
constant. Boom. Bond is strong. See the major lag spikes? What what did he do to my laptop? Damn. I think this is the right teleport right down. Ah, uh, 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 why can't I catch any in my mouth? Uh, okay. Sun's out. Oh, about time we had some dry heat. It's been so muggy lately. I'll just go up that way again. Ah, uh, ah, uh, 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 why can't I catch any in my mouth? Sorry, 
pal. But guess what? Tomorrow's Friday and I might be able to do a longer out. stream. About time we had some dry heat. It's been so muggy lately. <laughs> a longer stream, not a long stream. Back to like a five hour one. Hopefully. And if you were here before, I said probably next month, um, because I might be getting a new game. I would be like, wait a minute. Very good, in my opinion. Mass leaf flowers, I love it. Oh, yeah, I like collecting the blossoms and stuff. I'll get another old one. Right. Before I do anything, <laughs> you know what, but I want to do a dance game first, but I don't know if that's going to take the whole video. EP level one. Oh, 
Hey, what gives? Still breathing. I didn't even notice my health until I looked at my health bar. I'm not wrong. That lag during the state is bad. Still breathing. Something's happening with something and it's starting to live. No! What to do? Don't blame me. Uh, Hello, nice to meet you. My name is Young Lee. Okay. And my my spells just a help. No, it be pulse revelation. This what keeps revelation? This be revelation. This would be wealth. Well, it's a wealth of Ah. Uh, not yet. So let me just go to these beaches down here. Like, go across this coastline. Get, um... Shells. 
Because that's all I need to upgrade this character. Shells. And eventually when I get to 20 shells, then I'll be able to fully upgrade. Well, currently fully upgrade him. To level 70, I believe. Oh, anyway. There you are. Oh, I need to terrify! <laughs> Mini has to return! <laughs> There's some up here. Oh, there's a lot up here. Oh, what are you firing at, everyone? Stand with me. Bro. Wingblade. Uh, I suggest you run, my guy. I'm up here after I start attacking and I start to move. You chest you. Every little bit counts.
I can't have. Still so be spared now. I can't have a first team. It's seven more. That's all right. Shrine. Right. Then I have Just need a little more to upgrade this guy. She's gonna die from this one. Or not. Oh, seriously. Nice. Yes, here's one. One. Okay, there was only two. What? Oh, never mind. There's no one two. Three. Four more to go.
Pokemon up and install. So, I'm not sure that you can put random six damn lots of doll. Oh, and a brand new six leaf. I missed one too. This character kill the Emperor of Fire and Iron. <laughs> then an easy upgrade character. The second one. Would you look at that? Now, just one more Emperor of Fire and Iron. As you can see, items, 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 Emperor of Fire and Iron, which we also get that here. <laughs> see, he will give me one until the other one. I have no idea who this Shin Shin is. Sorry, pal. 
Okay, I messed up. I meant to have the the water. Yep. Let's do it again. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah.
32. Yes. Yes. Ascend. Damn, that uses so much. Oh, prosperity. That bad. Incoming healing bait. So more HP, thunder attack, charmed, charge drive with your whoa. What is the end? Oh yes. Ah, uh, it is Thursday. It's Thursday. I can get it. Same book. Same book. Well, that's where we're going. That's the next place we're doing. Because this guy needs to be upgraded to the best of its abilities. <laughs> Wait a minute. Isn't this the underwater place? How am I meant to get it? How am I meant to drain the water? Wait. No, this ain't fair. How do I drain the water? What? What quest is needed for this? Got fire up there. Two geo down here. Seriously? <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Is that what we need to do? Do I do that and then change it to a Jewish guy? Oh, no. Wait, what? Oh no, I forgot to change that. During everything else, the other one is the best one. Just for that? What? Oh, wow, well, that's nothing. Where do you want this stuff delivered to, boss? So there's a fire thing. But where is it now? It's a fire thing over here. Oh, this viewpoint would definitely be the thing. <laughs> might, might not be. Was this? Is thou? Okay, the thing of fire is over there. Who wait? So there's this fire thing up here, this tool again. This is just this tool I gotta do. Oh, wait. <laughs> Is 
Is that so good? One? Why do we have to build it? Oh, um, um. Have a good time. Leave it to me. Amber. So it isn't. Opening a chest is like unwrapping a gift. Then what in the heck is? I won't let you down. Like, what? Oh, I have no idea, but I need that zone to upgrade this character, and I don't even know what quest it is. Got it. I'll start my. Hey, um. Does anyone know what that quest I need is? Because, well, we we'll kind of need it. So, like, uh, the rest of my character. You know what quest it is? This abandoned temple does bear some marks of the Abyss, the Falcon of the West. Though it can soar in the wind, it ultimately does naught but hover under the light of the gods. Hmm? Oh, it's nothing. Let's head inside. It's lower than recommended. Yeah, because of these two. Make sure to hydrate. Not far now. Lima wonders what the Abyss heroes look like. Do they look something like the Abyss mages? Let's head further in first. If we do see that creature, that'll spare me the explanation either way.
Just a few abyss mages. Seems like that herald might have already left the abyss. It is chaos, and it is also destruction. It is a morass of inconceivable madness that encroaches upon this world's very foundations. That is why even the Dragon of the East, a servant of a deity, was unable to resist its corrosive powers. And the creatures of the Abyss desire nothing less than the overthrow of a world ruled by the Archons. You seem to know a lot about the Abyss, Dane. <laughs> well, we do have some history. I suppose that's as far as chit-chat goes. We should head to Wolvendom. Judging by the traces I'm following, their next appearance may be within the territory of that old wolf. Perhaps we may find our Abyss Herald there. Not very really hard to put it right over the Ooh, that's a fall. That's the end. Yes. Change this to shock the glass pain to your It's not like that. Well, okay with me for now. Do I get two of them? The one on this sign, Gladiator Final, and and this gladiator final here, then yeah, sure, I'll definitely trade it out, but it's bad. Ooh. 
can be built. Right out. Yep. Got the Chimer going on. Other one for time. Come on, man, that's pretty good in itself. 10k HP. Yeah, when I make it all great, it's going to be nice. That's going to. Definitely spiral for July. Right. Bam! An extra kale. Oh yeah, I mentioned. Shepard Sam. Yep. Uh, oh yes, this is, yeah, um, do you want to search in the suit? Oh. Adventure right, stop. And then back to dance, let Oh, oh, TCG. How did I walk in on this? So, Sucrose, the package you mentioned that you received before, it's not dangerous, is it? You need to be careful when you're opening packages. I once had a friend mail me some research materials, and all the bouncing around in transit caused a reaction. Once I opened it, oh, it let out a stench that could wake the dead. No. This package didn't contain any hazardous materials. Of course. A harmless sweetie, eh? Hey, Timaeus! What are you chatting about? And who might this be? Oh, oh, hello, you two. Uh, this is Sucrose. Hi, I'm Sucrose, Albedo's assistant. If you have any alchemy-related queries, you could always ask me. I do my best to help. Huh? Do I look nervous? My apologies. I don't get out too often. I'm usually in the laboratory where there aren't many others to talk to. That's okay. You don't have to force yourself. I'm unsure that once we get to know each other better, we'll become really good friends. Hey, aren't you the legendary traveler? Yep. The one who repelled Storm Terror? I've heard so many stories about you. Always wanted an opportunity to research you up close. Uh... Uh, what do you mean, research? <sighs> Sorry. Don't mind me. What am I saying? Well, never mind. So, what were you two talking about just now? Mm -hmm. Sucrose received a strange package recently. A strange package? Yes. I believe it's from a Sumero scholar who came here to study in Mondstadt. It's most likely a thank you gift for collaborating on some research together. Huh? A package from an academia scholar? Oh, then th there wasn't anything dangerous inside. Just a bunch of strange cards. I think I've seen Timaeus with some similar looking cards before. So I came to ask him about what they might be. Uh, you've you've seen me with some cards? <laughs> Maybe those were the testing cards used for distinguishing reagents. No, they didn't look like test cards. Here, have a look. Uh, do I really need to do the TCG? Oh, you meant these? Huh, Sucrose, have you really never seen these before? No. Never. Recently, I've been spending all my time up in the mountains working on cultivating pentatonic sweet flowers. Why? Is this an area of research that has started trending in the alchemical community during my absence? No. <laughs> you can definitely say that it's trending, but not as an area of research. It's a card game that's been getting really popular these days. 
It's called Genius Invocation TCG. Genius Invocation TCG! Yeah, we've been hearing about this game all over the place. But this is the first time we've ever actually seen any of the cards. We didn't know it had made it all the way to Mondstadt. Must be uh, pretty popular, huh? That's right. The game's been catching on lately. The Yae Publishing House in Inazuma has even published a series of light novels based on the game. The story is really good. It starts with a young guy in Sumeru who finds an ancient casket of tomes in the attic. He opens it and discovers that the soul of an ancient TCG player called the Crocodile King has been captured inside. It turns out that the Crocodile King was King Deshret's viceroy who battled an opponent named the Ibis King. During the match, the Crocodile King fell prey to his opponent's scheme and was sealed away in the casket of tomes. After being unexpectedly released by the kid, the Crocodile King possesses him and helps him to gradually climb the ranks and become a legendary TCG player. Uh, Timaeus. Huh? What's wrong, Sucrose? Uh, if you're interested in how the story plays out, I can lend you the novels. No. I was just thinking about that time you requested an extension on your progress report deadline, citing personal reasons for the delay. <clears throat> well, uh, I did go through a phase recently where I wasn't putting enough focus on my work, but it's under control now. I've committed to not even touch Genius Invocation TCG until I've made enough progress in my research. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's unfortunate. Oh? Why is that? Well, since it's a gift from a researcher I've collaborated with, I thought that I should at least try to learn the rules. That way, I could say that I at least tried to appreciate his gift. All right! And since it's a game from Sumeru, who knows? Playing it might even make you smarter! Okay, fine! Paimon's curious and would like to give it a try. Please? Although... It seems like we can't learn how to play it anytime soon, cause... Timaeus has given up for a while. <laughs> well, research is my priority, you know. But if you'd like to learn the rules of Genius Invocation TCG, then I'd actually suggest you go to the Cat's Tale. Yep, that's the place. It's where everyone in the community goes to play when they have time. They gather there, trade cards, and they're very welcoming to new players. Trying to learn the rules can be intimidating at first, but it's a lot of fun once you get the hang of it. Understood. Traveler, Paimon, let's go to the cat's tail and try asking around. Mm -hmm. To be honest, hearing Timaeus talking about the game has also piqued my curiosity. Well, what are we waiting for? Let's get going! Um, uh, okay. Oh, plus man. Flower. I like I have like a bajillion, bajillion flower already. Um. Add Astra Abyssosk. Mm -hmm. Thank you for completing today's commissions. Here is your reward. Nice. Add Astra Abyssosk. Ooh. That's a scholar lens. I have no idea where to find those. Oh, it's an attack as well. Can you recharge? Okay. Add Astra Abyssosk. Oh, 
Ad Astra Abyssosk. And the mission is done. No, 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 no. Before I go to Wolf, I can actually go DM run up to them. Damn, why is it so hot? It's in the middle of the night. Yeah, the marker. Well, yeah. we're in Wolfendom now. Think Dean's waiting for us up ahead? We should meet up with him quick, in case the wolves decide they don't like him. Here we are. Lord of Wolfendom, great wolf king of the north. Sharp of fang and keen of claw. And yet dwelling here only. No, nor does it know me. I only know these things because a previous traveling companion of mine once wanted to hear its story. All right, let's go see if that Abyss Herald has stopped by here. Well, where do we begin? Hmm, are you standing here because of these strange bonfires, Dean? Indeed. See that, floating above the flames? It's an abyssal spell. Knowing what I do of the Order's habits, they've probably left similar marks behind elsewhere. Let's have a look nearby. <laughs> Sorry, pal! If I remember correctly, I put quiet set room. <laughs> Those monsters by the bonfire are under the abyss order's control? Looks kind of scary. Let's beat them up first. Fires also got something to do with the abyss.
the abyss he takes. Where do these monsters pop out from? Let's clear them out and quick! Windblade! Get moving! Have you finished searching? I searched around these parts and found some signs myself. But they were left behind by abyss mages, and there was no deeper abyssal power to them. It seems that even an abyss herald would not wish to make trouble with the Wolf King of the North. We should leave as well. If there's anything praiseworthy about that old wolf, it's his territorial nature. But now we're out of leads! Are we going to have to give up? No. There is one more place we can go. Let's get a move on then. I'll wait for you at Storm Terror's lair. Nice. Storm Terror's lair. I don't eight full HP. I need you to have a more HP. I have it a map, said. There aren't many dudes more to be leveled up. Like 2000 base HP. The thing that's carrying you is the artifacts. Then. And then. I've heard about what happened to you during Mondstadt's crisis. When you came, this place was known as Storm Terror's Lair. But I suppose that this place is more Lair than Storm Terror at this point. In fact, if my memory serves, this ruin has had largely nothing to do with that dragon for a long time. The first time I laid eyes upon the ruins of old Mondstadt, the Dragon of the East had yet to fall much less come to nest in this place. Huh? But Baima remembers that Tavalin first got in trouble hundreds of years ago. Don't think too much about it. How does Paimon remember that? Do you remember the light actuators that once sealed this ruin? If the Abyss Order is interested in this location, then they will not neglect those mechanisms. Let's go see what the situation is at those light actuators. Let's go. Look, there are lots of monsters gathered over there. <laughs> Stop it now! I'll settle this! Dissipate! Stop right there! Prepare to be blown away! Our bond is 
Call not having to gaze upon such a creature a shame exactly. Still, I do believe that you will come across one eventually. N no, you're right. If it's a really powerful monster, it would be best to go around it. <sighs> How good it would be if all perils one encounters in their journeys could simply be solved by going around them. Once upon a time, yes. I simply have experience from adventuring together with that traveling companion. Uh, you know, Dean, you keep talking about that person this and that person that? Where are they now, anyway? He... <sighs> no longer travels. I'm afraid that traveling can be too exhausting at times. Oh, is that how it is? Well, why are you traveling alone, then? I still have some things left unfinished. Once they are done, I too will return home to rest. <sighs> yep! And it's good to have a home to come back to, isn't it? We camp out a lot when we travel. Hey, once you find your sibling, we should find a place to stay too, shouldn't we? Mm, Mondstadt's fisherman's toast is pretty tasty. Mm. But Liyue's Wanmin restaurant is great too. <laughs> We should settle down in a place where there's good food. Home. Well, it won't be too late to think about where you stay once your journey reaches its end. While you're still traveling, you should... Huh? What's familiar? A familiar feeling, you say? It could be someone you know well, or perhaps a monster. Whichever it is, we should see it for ourselves, and thus see clearly. We can reach the top of that cliff from over there. Let's go. Let's go indeed. I believe this is when I learn oh, about my brother. Oh, really fast, doesn't he? Let's use that wind current nearby to catch up. Can you still sense that familiar feeling that you spoke of earlier? But it doesn't feel like there's anything around here. No monsters, no people, nothing. Indeed. There doesn't seem to be anything strange about this place. It doesn't look any different from the last time I was here. My traveling companion brought me here on our previous journey. Hmm. So, Dane, what about you? What's your favorite place? Me? I no longer remember. I merely followed my traveling companion around on that journey. That's all there was to it. Huh? A ruin guard's footprint. A ruin guard was wandering around here? No peace to be found, even for a single dandelion. You only 
only touch that dandelion for a second. Hmm. Perhaps that dandelion bears some sort of scent that only you recognize. As for why, has it perhaps experienced something related to you? Uh, you're saying some real confusing stuff. Do not rush. Vexation and anxiety are the enemy of rational thought. Your journey has only just begun, has it not? At least you now know that he is still on this world. At this time, the most important thing is the journey to find him itself. Yes, and this is something you must keep in mind as the meaning behind your journey. May you find your kin at the end of that journey. Well then, let us part ways here for now. Huh? You're leaving? Already? Yes, Only yes. for now. Don't worry, we will meet again. After all, I did take 500 mora and those three answers you gave me. Got Excluding the Eisenstein. Yeah, the Lee um map was introduced before Dragonspine was, if I'm correct. It should be. I know, I was playing before that. Yeah, before the um, dragons, uh, dragon spine came out, I was playing on my personal account. Now I have a cheat sheet. Should be stretched out. No. I won't be doing the TCG. Yes, that's gonna be next episode. Exploring the TCG and defeating all of its rivals. Yes. That indeed can be something. But it's nuts. Nice. Oh, this is the fishing one. So, senior fisherman of the Monster Fishing Association recently, many new fish species has appeared in the nearby waters. I immediately contacted my friends in other regions, and sure enough, this has been. Some people say that this must be the Tevat fish outbreak of the century. Actually, the reason hasn't been fully investigated, but it's something to do with the improvement of the ecological environment. So, you are young, but you are. Mm, so you guys are in trouble because there are too many fish, right? Don't worry, Paimon. I will take care of it. Uh, don't worry, Paimon will take care of it long, as long as they don't taste bad. Uh -huh, um, it's no trouble. In fact, there's more fish. Is uh, more fish. The better as far as the fishing association is concerned. However, we need enough manpower. And to be honest, with the manpower we have available, we'd be hard pressed to catch all the new fish species species for research in a short time. But on the flip side, I thought isn't a great opportunity for the fishing association to grow. I put out a commission with the Adventurers Guild. Well how about it? Interested with in joining us? Fishing a lot is fun. Yeah. Great. With your erratic uh what an erratic energetic Youngster, you are. So let's start by going to Cider Lake. That's where the fishing grounds I have prepared for newcomers newcom is. I'll teach you the basics first. Looks like we're fishing. Damn. Isn't this the same place? Okay. 
Well, let's go. This place will do. See those fish? They're so beautiful. Here, take some of these tools. We have fishing rods, bait, and formulas for making bait. First, place the bait on the hook, aim where you're fishing, so the fish are gathered, and cast your rod. Then dutifully wait for the fish to take the bait. I've heard that newcomers have something called beginner's luck. I caught a large bass when that was more than half a meter long back then. We'll go and give it a try. Here's to catching another pineal. Hey, you shall, you shall have no other Paimon before this Paimon. Paimon? What a strange name. Is that a kind of fish? Sort of a wondrous seafood that I managed to catch last time. Hey, when did Paimon go from emergency food to wondrous seafood? You never were emergency food. Ah, uh, I see. I didn't realize you were already an experienced angler. Well, then that just makes it even more ex I'm not even me more excited to see what you'll catch. Yay! Fishing! I know how to fish. I had- that was an important message that I missed. Paiwan is not for- I never said she was food! Not even once, you can look back on everything, you can even see that I have never Ever, ever said Paimon, the sword. Oh, whoa. Uh, I guess I'll use this common bait first. in the wrong bait then. Paimon's stomach is rumbling already! 
have an achievement as well for that. Wait, I got more achievement? There's a piece of fish, that's one for you. You were almost catching up with me back when I was in my glory days. Okay, man. Ah, it seems like these are no ordinary fish I'll walk in the park for you. I should consider giving you something more challenging. You might not know this, but even fish from the same species can have huge differences between individuals because of its living environment and food. Even though they all look the same, some individuals are particularly active and energetic. They jump out of the water from time to time and are very eye-catching. These individuals are superior by far in terms of commercial and aesthetic value. I mean, many hobbyists buy them at high prices and keep them at home in their tanks for a ornamental or piano observing purposes. This is why some fish are called... I don't know. Farmer's not food, but there's no other option! No, there isn't. How there can can there be so many kind of pine ones? Yeah, that's precisely how it works. Look, looks like you've gotten it already. Recently, there has been many fish active in these waters near Stormbearer's Mountain, which I have marked on your map. Let's go over and check it out. Okay. Um. Looks like I'm going to the mountain, there. Eh? We're going for a fishing journey. Hopefully not for a while. Uh, we're not gonna fish for a long time. Hell you! That other one. different. Oh, then you got like a swordfish look at them.
was a tough fight. Yes. Paimon's stomach is rumbling already! Yep, I saw three different types of cheetahs, so good. Right, but I'm ready to stop it for this, um, merchant. So far, everyone in this in my current household. My big brother is the only one that has called Paimon emergency food. The only one. I'm sure definitely one of those possible channels. Really sorry, I understand me and estimate the or no, I am estimate the elites of the eventuals your guests. I should hurry up and put out more commissions. I've got to attract talent like you to join the fishing association if that's the last thing I do. By the way, even with the fishing gear, if you need to the fishing gear in the future, you can just swing by our fishing association to have uh, look, our prices are pretty reasonable. Heh, <laughs> not to brag or anything, but we do have a good collection of fine goods. Mm. Uh, isn't this just like the better of the fishing one? Quiet for exchange? Ooh. You should have understood it as well. Whoa! So the more I fish, the better it is. Okay. Um, time, time. Ah, I've got half an hour left. Don't know, don't know. Well, let's go here then. Only one of the things I know. And then we can go do like a world quest or something. We are so close on being able to do this. Oh, who's this guy? Is he Jones Philo? Oh, you're here, Traveller? Allow me to introduce... Joseph... 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 Who's Joe's father? Dad, this is that Traveller I was telling you about. This is the Traveller that helped me find out loads in the past. This time we even built a, a snowman together. Joe has told me everything about you. I can't thank you enough. <laughs> Wow, this is amazing. Not bad, Palad. 
Not bad at all. You did great work this time. This time. Because something happened the last time. Uh, you remember the person I said I found last time on Dragonspine, right? After you accompanied me up the mountain and helped me defeat those monsters, I continued searching the area. During my search, I accidentally tripped and rolled my way down the mountain. You rolled? Thankfully, the snow was very thick below. I wasn't hurt. And I was getting ready to head back when I heard noises at the side and someone popped out of nowhere. I didn't realize that was the person I was looking for at first. In fact, I mistook him for a fellow adventurer in the search party. But after a few words of conversation, it was clear that he was having memory problems. He didn't even know his own name. The temperature was freezing and there was no time to deal with that then and there, so I convinced him to come back to the camp with me and figure everything else after we got there. We got back to the camp, ran into, ran into Joel, and the moment he saw him, he froze for a second with, with, him, with this completely stunned expression on his face, and then he started crying out, Dad, Dad! That's when Joseph suddenly started to remember. That is a word I will not be said. Um, Joseph, you don't remember anything else at all? The boar princess feeding the foxes? I'm so sorry, I have no re recollection. Maybe it's because of my head trauma, I'm not sure. I woke up and found myself covered in blood. My things were gone and there was nothing to indicate who I was or how I got there. I crawled into a cave and settled for a slow recovery. After my legs, feet were better, my hunting skills were what kept me alive. Gaming is just Chinese. <laughs> we play. You mean like the opposite? Nice opinion. Dad, I was so worried about you. Alright, Joel, don't cry. Papa's not gonna go anywhere. I'm here to stay. What's your na what's your plan now? I just want to stay with my family for a little while longer. It's wonderful that you were able to return safe and sound. I suppose there's a happy ending now. Ha <laughs> ha. That said, Pallet, you still got some way to go before your adventuring skills are up to scratch. I mean, losing your footing and rolling down the mountain like that? You're having some romance classes with me once we get back to the guild, I say. Uh-huh, but, but curious, I think I kind of made up my mistake this time, you know? No buts, back to the guild we go. Guildmaster, please! Ha ha ha. Quest completed. Have we got enough time for a world quest? Um. No, that's a fontaine mission. That's a fontaine mission. That's a people mission. That's for a long later in the future of the mission. <laughs> It's currently in another quest, you can tell, I've got to feel that... Your TCG? Oh. TCG is tomorrow, and future news problem to deal with. Because I wasn't, I'm not very good at that TCG stuff. Uh, hello, Paimon. Dumb. People from Mondstadt hardly ever come here. Even though it's not so far away from the city, the environment here is totally untouched. It's a wild place ruled by the laws of nature. It's survival of the fittest out here. Even the slimes around here are huge. Like those super duper massive ones over there. Uh... Did you just... Nah, I'm not gonna settle for that, you know?
That wasn't that hard. <laughs> This guy, this guy, I kind of know this guy, Razor. Favonius. They are friends. I am Razor. I am no knight. Uh, oh. My wolf pack. They are my family. Your family? Yes. They raised me. We live together. We are family. So many questions. So little time. They are angry with me. I help you. Exposed our ambush. Boar ran away. Ah, oh, don't worry. Paimon will get her friend to catch you another boar. She's stronger than she looks. N no, no need. When knights try to help, wolves go hungry. Don't be silly. Wait here. We won't screw this up. Just watch. Uh, I hope. So I use the hunting trap, lay down the trap, which can be destroyed though. Hunting boars cannot find some traps to not attract boars. The boars tend to avoid people and run away in the exact opposite direction, using this to your advantage to ensure them with the traps to get more warm. Huh? Uh, hmm. Huh? <laughs> Told you we could do it! I. Thanks. But wolves catch five or six every hunt. <sighs> Tonight they go hungry. Uh, oh. Don't worry. You tried. At least you did better than other night friend. The red one. Bernie girl. Chung Yun? Yeah, if she was here, whole mountain is fire. Can't catch even one boar. <laughs> mm. I must go now. Here is not safe. Careful. Always watching. I know Chong Lin. He's an ice character. What a weirdo. <laughs> Bernie girl? From the Knights of Favonius? What is he? Hmm. Who do you think it is? Uh, it's either one of the two. There's two of them that I'm thinking of. <laughs> yeah, the Outrider. Ha ha ha. Oh, I could have missed this. Like, whoa, there's a lot here. Hey, what gives? So can I not upgrade the weapons anymore? Yeah, the can actually. It's not that sense, and I'm definitely going to add this to the trail. But for two opportunities, those are. Yep. These people are just. 
I can move it up with it. Which I actually might want to do. I can upgrade all of my weapons. Mm. Tomorrow I'll be able to do this. Sergeant thing, I've been getting them. I think I'll be able to upgrade that soon. This, this is something. Now this is something that I can do. Number three. I know Chong Yu. I don't have Chong Yu. Although I've watched this recent person that's doing like a Chong Yu's adventure without a go to it. Hmm. A lot of them recommend that. Okay, wait, what is the recommended stat? Fire and ice. Oh, I'll be okay. Yeah. Oh, no. Oh, yeah, bed drops. Many happy returns. Die on two of my characters. I know why my other guy was about to die. For no reason, incredibly easy. But that was incredibly easy.
reason these two don't do much damage or this girl doesn't have a lot of uh, attributes because I'm not in Inazuma yet. When I get to Inazuma, I'm going to go for such a massive hunt that I might make things go extinct in the game. Because I'm going to be leveling up in characters like from no tomorrow. <laughs> Wait. Hi, Paimon. Hi, Traveler. What can I do for you? Hi, Amber. Hi. Looks like you've got a bit of time on your hands. Uh-oh, here it comes. I've been rushed off my feet recently, and Outrider's duties never end, so... Wanna help? Told you so. Recently, wolves have been attacking the carts at Drunkard Gorge. As you know, wolves are dangerous, but they do have their own rules. Mondstadt's wolves don't normally venture outside of the Bright Crown Mountains in Wolvendom. Yes! Paimon heard someone say that those areas do have their own set of rules, even though they are wild and untouched by humans. That's right. So for wolves to be showing up around Drunker Gorge is very unusual. Speaking of wolves, do you happen to know a wolf boy from Wolvendom? Uh, who? I've never heard of anyone like that around Mondstadt. Wait! Red one? Bernie girl? That ain't you? Bernie? What are you talking about? Anyway, I'm off to Drunkard Gorge to investigate. Come with me! Something's happening. That ain't no wolf pack. Looks like it's the hilly trails attacking the carts after all. Huh. Not such a mystery after all. Enough talk. Let's go help out. You're not gonna do anything. I'm the one gonna be doing everything. Stand with me. Yeah. 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 So, the hilly churls have been starting to flex their muscles on the back of the wolf scare. That's right. But I must say, if you think the hilly churls are a nasty lot, the wolves are even worse. They... they attacked Springvale this morning. Springvale? That's crazy! It's unheard of. I thought I would take my chances on the road after the wolves had their fun. I never thought the hilly churls would show up too. We should head there soon and see how bad the situation is. But first things first, you should assess the damage to your cart. Does it still work? I'll take a look. Oh dear. This is awful. Poor lad can't even stand. That's terrible. Except he's not 
actually injured. Right. It's awful. The wolves frighten him so badly that he's paralyzed with fear. That really is awful. Do you remember any significant details of what you saw? I... I've never seen a wolf in my life before today. It was terrifying. No details then, huh? Let's investigate the area again. Yay. These claw marks. From them, we can tell the number and size of the wolves. This time, there were at least two wolves. And they must be... Yes, yes. They must be at least two meters high. Hey, wolves are mysterious creatures. It's not like you see them every day. Perfect. They're hungry. They're hungry. Wolfer. I heard that in Liyue, they make calligraphy brushes out of this stuff. The color looks nothing like Mondstadt wolf fur, based on what the books say. Could it be that they're from somewhere else entirely? Hair looks different at every place on the body. Same applies to wolves. You don't know where it's from. <laughs> Pardon? But look at this. Another hair. But what's that stuck to it? It's the seed of a wolf hook berry. Look, there are little hooks on the seed. The only places this grows in Mondstadt are Wolvendom and Bright Crown Canyon. So it's Wolvendom wolves after all? From that area, yes. But it could be that there are other wolf packs encroaching on their territory. This doesn't tell us everything, but it does give us a strong lead. Enough to start investigating. I'll go and see to the villagers before we head off. Nice. How is your investigation coming along? What? You're standing! Yes, I see. I have recovered, thankfully. I managed to claw my way back out of the depths of hell. So, Knights of Favonius, what have you found out? From inspecting the wolf fur left at the scene, we can tell that the wolves came from Wolvendom. Beyond that, we don't know anything. But please remain calm. I will head to Wolvendom shortly and get to the bottom of this. The Knights of Avonius will not allow this danger to continue any longer. Good. Better late than never, I suppose. How rude! In the meantime, we'll just have to keep dealing with this on our own. Please, don't do anything stupid. <laughs> we do things a bit differently around here. You Favonius lot probably aren't used to it. They will pay for what they've done. <laughs> Goodbye. It's awful. It really is. What is? Their future outlook, I mean. Young people can be so impulsive sometimes. If it's not too much to ask, I hope you can keep an eye on them. Stop them from getting into trouble. It's no trouble. That's what we're here for. Even though that guy really isn't much of a charmer. Leave it to us. Uh, off to Wolvendom we go. We shall indeed. 
Although I don't think I'll be able to fight a boss within five minutes. So, if it is to the boss, we're going to be doing that at the start of next episode. And then TCG. No, start of next episode, we do that. And then, um... <sighs> and then dailies, then... Rish. Razor! Sup, my man? Who's there? Chill out, Razor! It's only us! You... are also Knight? So, you don't know each other after all? No. This girl also red, but not so Bernie, like other girl. I know exactly who they're talking about. It's it's thing, it's him. Clee! It's clean. This is starting to make sense. Is this the wolf boy you were talking about? Correct. His name is Razor. Help me out. With what? No time. I sent Lupa call away. People coming. Bad people. Those guys from earlier? I understand, but first, I have a few questions. I smell blood. Quick! Blood? I hope the wolves didn't attack those idiots. Great, let's go. First off. <laughs> Blood droplets. Not human blood. Wolf blood. Lupa call blood. Lupa what now? Are you gonna tell us what it means yet? Lupa call is family fate gave me. When wolf accepts human as its own, or human accepts wolf, that is Lupa call. Sounds like gibberish to me. That's strange. Where does the word come from? Surely it wasn't made up by the wolves. It's just the name he gave. Who's he? Guardian of this land. Wouldn't that be Barbados, though? He is the ruler of Mondstadt. Enough! Another clue. Follow me. Hey, so wait! He's this no is your step. chance to prove your innocence! <sighs> he's already gone. He's like a new skin. First off, these guys, you guys are all gonna go. This is him. We find his blood. Bad men did this. Oh, how terrible. I do agree that it's awful, but that doesn't change the fact that... We didn't attack village, not us. A black wolf and his pack, not from here. They tried to take over land. They broke the code. Whose code? Guardian of this land. That's now the second time you've brought that up. Tell us who that is. I take Lupa call further in. Follow me. Maybe you see. <laughs> Sorry, pal. If that one from earlier was two meters high, imagine how high this one must be! What's this? 
They're so huge. Big. Oh, luckily I have all my ultimates ready. Help me collect these. Aren't those wolf hook seeds? Crush them. Put on wound. Bleeding stop. It's true. Wolf hook seeds have a liquid coating that not only functions as a mild painkiller, but also has a hemostatic effect. I read that in a book. Why? I have no idea. Hooks help seeds move. Liquid stops pain and bleeding. Animal doesn't feel hooks. They take seeds far away. Purple teacher told me so. I stay here. Take care of this one. I answer Red Girl's questions. Right. And if that lot does come back, I doubt they will try their luck against a member of the Knights of Favonius. Your wolf friend is not clear of my suspicion just yet. But we'll still need to fetch those seeds. I have a water in them, I guess not. I guess so. I guess not. I guess so. We're back! Have we got enough? Yes, enough. I'm just feeling like you feel in Call of Duty. And in every other. Razor was just telling me about the Wolven Code of Conduct. Mind blowing stuff. Thank you. We've looked everywhere and haven't seen any other wolves. <sighs> yep, that's wolves for you. The one we managed to capture must have been sick or something. What are you doing here? Revenge! It's him! The one who was raised by wolves! Huh? So, it was you! I should have known wolves aren't smart enough to be behind this! I can't believe you would help wolves plot against humans! They throw you some scraps and you treat them like kin? Have you forgotten what you are? Uh -oh. Enough! Yeah! You can't talk about Razor like that! The Knights of Favonius are gonna let this guy off? We did not raid village! What is this disturbance to which I awaken? Ooh. <sighs> this is no offering to Boreas. Ah, uh, yeah, um, we Not shall- only do you come for my kind, so too do you fail to recognize your own transgression. We have to leave now because of, well, it is past the time of end. Yes, I'm sorry about that. I am very sorry about that. Uh, but thank you for watching to the end. Um, glad you could join. I know it was right, right before a boss battle, but as I said, I can't do a boss battle. Not at all. Um, because that would definitely go way beyond the time. We can do that boss battle tomorrow. And that's what you can look forward to. So. Um. I hope all of you have a great day. Or night, depending on when and where you're watching this. Um. And again, thank you for watching to the end. And for the people on YouTube, on the right here is my latest video. On the left here will be my first video of this series. In the center here shall be a subscribe button. If you like more videos like this one, um, if you like more videos like this one, please consider subscribing and clicking that notification bell if you want to see um, any more, any more, uh, more of this content. Long stream will be tomorrow. I'll see you all next time. Tomorrow. Bye.